What are the differences between Perl, Python, or Consed? What are the main differences among them? And in which typical scenarios is it better to use each language? In order of appearance, the languages are said, awk, Perl, Python. The said program is a stream editor and is designed to apply the actions from a script to each line, or, more generally, to specified ranges of lines, of the input file or files. Its language is based on ed, the Unix editor, and although it has conditionals and so on, it is hard to work with for complex tasks. You can work minor miracles with it, but at a cost to the hair on your head. However, it is probably the fastest of the programs when attempting tasks within its remit. It has the least powerful regular expressions of the programs discussed, adequate for many purposes, but certainly not PCRE, Perl compatible regular expressions. The AUK program, named from the initials of its authors, Aho, Weinberger, and Kernighan, is a tool initially for formatting reports. It can be used as a souped up said, in its more recent versions, it is computationally complete. It uses an interesting idea, the program is based on patterns matched and actions taken when the pattern matches. The patterns are fairly powerful, extended regular expressions. The language where the actions is similar to C. One of the key features of AUK is that it splits the input automatically into records and each record into fields. Perl was written in part as an op killer and said killer. Two of the programs provided with it are A2P and S2P for converting aux scripts and said scripts into Perl. Perl is one of the earliest of the next generation of scripting languages, TCL slash TK can probably claim primacy. It is powerful integrated regular expression handling with a vastly more powerful language. It provides access to almost all system calls and has the extensibility of the CPAN modules. Neither Ock nor Set is extensible, one of Perl's mottos is Tauti. there's more than one way to do it, pronounced him Toti. Perl has objects, but it is more of an add-on than a fundamental part of the language. Python was written last, and probably in part as a reaction to Perl. It has some interesting syntactic ideas, indenting to indicate levels, no braces or equivalents. It is more fundamentally object-oriented than Perl, it is just as extensible as Perl. Okay, when to use each? Said, when you need to do simple text transforms and files, awk, when you only need simple formatting and summarization or transformation of data, Perl, for almost any task, but especially when the task needs complex regular expressions, Python, for the same tasks that you could use Perl for. I'm not aware of anything that Perl can do that Python can't nor vice versa. The choice between the two would depend on other factors. I learned Perl before there was a Python, so I tend to use it. Python has less accreted syntax and is generally somewhat simpler to learn. Perl 6, when it becomes available, will be a fascinating development. Note that the overviews of Perl and Python, in particular, are woefully incomplete, Whole books could be written on the topic. After mastering a few dozen languages, you get tired of people like S. Lot, see his controversial answer to this question, nearly half as many downvotes as up, plus 45 slash 22, six years after answering. Sed is the best tool for extremely simple command line pipelines. In the hands of a Sed master, it's suitable for one-offs of arbitrary complexity, but it should not be used in production code except in very simple substitution pipelines. Stuff like slash this slash that slash. Orc, the new Orc, is by far the best choice for complex data reformatting when there is only a single input source and a single output, or multiple outputs sequentially written. Since a great deal of real-world work conforms to this description, and a good programmer can learn Gork in two hours, 
it is the best choice. On this planet, simpler and faster is better. Perl or Python are far better than any version of Orpulset when you have very complex input slash output scenarios. The more complex the problem is, the better off you are using Python, from a maintenance and readability standpoint. Note, however, that a good programmer can write readable code in any language, and a bad programmer can write unmaintainable crap in any useful language, so the choice of Perl or Python can safely be left to the preferences of the programmer if said programmer is skilled and clever. I wouldn't call set a fully-fledged programming language, it is a stream editor with language constructs aimed at editing text files programmatically. Awk is a little more of a general-purpose language but it is still best suited for text processing. Perl and Python are fully-fledged, general-purpose programming languages. Perl has its roots in text processing and has a number of Awk-like constructs, there is even an Awk to Perl script floating around on the net. There are many differences between Perl and Python, your best bet is probably to read the summaries of both languages on something like Wikipedia to get a good grasp on what they are. First, there are two unrelated things in the list Perl, Python awk and said. Thing 1, Simplistic Text Manipulation Tools said it has a fixed relatively simple scope of work defined by the idea of reading and examining each line of a file said is not designed to be particularly readable it is designed to be very small and very efficient on very tiny unix servers awk it has a slightly less fixed less simple scope of work however the main loop of an awk program is defined by the implicit reading of lines of a source file these are not complete programming languages while you can, with some work, write fairly sophisticated programs in awk, it rapidly gets complicated and difficult to read. Thing 2, General Purposes Programming Languages These have a rich variety of statement types, numerous built-in data structures, and no wired-in assumptions or shortcuts to speak of. Perl? Python? When to use them? Said? Never? It really doesn't have any value in the modern era of computers with more than 32k of memory. Perl or Python to do the same things more clearly. Awk? Never? Like said, it reflects an earlier era of computing. Rather than maintain this language, in addition to all the other required for a successful system, it's more pleasant to simply do everything in one pleasant language. Perl? Any programming problem of any kind, if you like free-thinking syntax, where there are many, many ways to do the same thing, Perl is fun. Python Any programming problem of any kind. If you like fairly limited syntax, where there are few choices, less subtlety, and, perhaps, more clarity. Python's object-oriented nature makes it more suitable for large, complex problems. Background, I'm not bashing said and awk out of ignorance. I learned awk over 20 years ago. Did many things with it, used to teach it as a core Unix skill. I learned Perl about 15 years ago. Did many sophisticated things with it. I've left both behind because I can do the same things in Python, and it is simpler and more clear. There are two serious problems with said and awk, neither of which are their age. The incompleteness of their implementation. Everything said in Octu can be done in Python or Perl, often more simply and sometimes faster, too. A shell pipeline has some performance advantages because of its multiprocessing. Python offers a subprocess module to allow me to recover those advantages. The need to learn yet another language. By doing things in Python, or Perl, your implementation depends on fewer languages, with a resulting increase in clarity.